Boeing Starliner is the sixth new vehicle NASA has launched since the first crewed Mercury flight in 1961. It is the second to be designed by a commercial entity, following SpaceX, which began crewed missions with its Dragon spacecraft in 2020. Boeing Starliner capsule blasts off Monday to the International Space Station on its first crewed mission. The Starliner is scheduled to rocket off to the International Space Station Monday at 10.34 p.m. Eastern Time with astronauts Butch Wilmore and Suni Williams. Starliner will be propelled into orbit by an Atlas V rocket made by United Launch Alliance, a Boeing Lockheed Martin joint venture. Starliner is scheduled to arrive at the ISS at about 5 o'clock Greenwich Mean Time Wednesday, and remain there for a little over a week. Tests will be performed to check it is working properly, and then Williams and Wilmore will reboard the capsule to return home. Boeing has a contract with NASA to fly the Starliner to the International Space Station six times through the end of the decade. NASA plans to alternate its flights to the ISS between the SpaceX Dragon and Boeing Starliner, with each company flying once each year at six-month intervals. Following next week's flight with NASA astronauts, Boeing's first official mission, Starliner 1, is scheduled for spring 2025. NASA said it's possible some of the space station's international partners will fly astronauts on Starliner beginning next year. Russian cosmonauts are not expected to join until at least 2026, after Starliner has successfully completed its first long-duration flight. NASA Launch Weather Officer Brian Sizek said there is a 95% chance Starliner will launch as planned. If weather scrubs the launch, NASA will try again on May 7 at 10.11 p.m. Eastern Time and has additional backups planned for May 10 and 11th.